Omaha, Nebraska, what some people consider a flyover city, but those cities are oftentimes our favorites. Known for its world-renowned zoo and College World Series, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised at some of the things you can see here. Welcome to Omaha, everybody. Our first stop here in this beautiful city is here at the Henry Dorley Zoo. And fun fact, this zoo ranks within the top five zoos in the entire world. So we're so excited to visit today. Let's go check it out. We're here in the Desert Dome for our first stop. And this is the world's largest indoor desert. It kind of winds all throughout the dome. You get to see the different areas in the desert and the different animals. Very, very cool. Kawati. If you know, you know. My dreams have come true. I'm in a butterfly forest. I don't know that I've ever been in a butterfly. Um, area, have you? Yeah. This is awesome. Follow the butterflies, follow the butterflies. I don't know that one. Follow the butterflies. So the lead jungle is closed. Brit, that looks pretty cool. I saw it on their website, so I kind of expected it. Oh well. Sam thinks he's an animal whisperer. Cheetah was hardcore chilling. It's crazy that there's houses right there, right by the zoo. I would love a house like that. Come to the zoo, bring your walking shoes. It's massive. I'm glad I was prepared. Aquariums are my absolute favorite. They just want to get out. up at the zoo it took us like two and a half hours maybe I think that's like super fast we set up a whole day just for the zoo we finished very early I wanted to mention because we didn't vlog this day but Omaha apparently is known to have started the Reuben some New Yorkers think otherwise but we had our first Reuben the night we got to Omaha at this brew house or brewery and I have to say Reubens are like now one of my favorite things. They're so good. I didn't expect to like it as much as I did, but we went to, what was it called? Bacon Beer Garden. What he said, whatever that German word is. Bacon Beer Garden. It was a cool atmosphere. We were looking for something like to have a cool atmosphere in. I recommend that place. Got a late start this morning, but we had to make a stop at a coffee shop because we didn't have any coffee at the place. Or we really just got <laughs> the Starbucks glass drinks that were awful. Probably the most Instagrammable coffee shop or anything we've ever eaten. I mean, yeah, it was like it was picture perfect, <laughs> like the the way they presented like the food and the drinks. We shared the toast flight and the coffee flight. And that was plenty for both of us. I mean, the toasts were huge and packed. We're walking across the Iowa and Nebraska border on the Bob Carey Pedestrian Bridge. We're literally gonna stand in two states. the thing to do. So it's quite windy day today but we've come out to the Jean Lehi Mall and it's this outdoor like park area right by the river with the most beautiful view of downtown. 
Yeah, I'm good. I gotta give a big props to Omaha because this place is really cool. We don't see a lot of big cities where you can find something like this, where you can just hang out, bring the kids, bring the family, and just have a good time out in the outdoors. Go down this slide. Oh, shoot! <laughs> So right next to the mall is the old market. It's a shopping district. So we're going to walk around, see what kind of shops we come across. The sun's coming out finally. So super excited to be outside and see what the old market has to offer here in the mall. The buildings here are so beautiful. They're old and like rustic looking and the vines and the trees are kind of growing up on the sides of the buildings. It's really super cool. I'm in this place called Hollywood Candy Store. It's a candy store, but it also has this old retro stuff in it. It's really cool, very unique. The old market has this passageway. Look how beautiful this is. Oh my gosh, and there's shops all around that you can shop at. several recommendations for steakhouses and you can't decide so you're flipping a coin. Let's do it. <laughs> Catch, flip. Tails. Gotta show you tails. It is tails. That's a dirty coin though. We're at the Drover here in Omaha, Nebraska. And yeah, we came here for dinner and we're gonna see how it is. One of Omaha's most iconic steakhouses. Let's go. Ten ounce sirloin. Wonderful. How was yours? <laughs> so the car's packed. We're headed back to Kansas City where our travel nursing assignment is at the moment. We've really, really enjoyed our time in Nebraska and this is our 25th state. How cool is that? Over the past year, we've been kind of visiting places that aren't so known for tourism and I hope we've been encouraging you to get out of your comfort zone, visit those places untouched and just you'll never know what you're going to get up to and what cities you're really going to enjoy the most. I'm so glad you guys are enjoying our Midwest series and see you on the next one.